Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough, Dungeon Times! Oh, this must be the Temple of Ice! There's a blizzard howling outside, but it's actually pretty warm inside. Yeah, at least we'll get out of the cold here, hey, eh, Link? Well, yeah, I guess so, but, uh, I, I don't know how the ice would still be around if, you know, it was warm inside, but, okay! <laughs> Maybe she's saying that it's less cold because, well, you know, we're indoors, we're outside of the draft, and yeah, maybe that's what she's saying. I don't know, I don't know. Oh, blue choo-choo. You, get out of my way. You have to get that. I'm tapping you. That, there we go. <laughs> I was just, just barely inside the range of a regular strike, but not quite there, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so hitting this. Will allow us to do something here. Now you can do this two ways. Um, either bombs or bomb chews. I'm gonna choose bomb because I can throw it from a distance and then run, 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 and bomb chews are a little bit less up. Oh, well, that kind of sucked, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's how you do that section. Alrighty. Okay, and we're also going up to another floor. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna be back here later. Don't worry. <laughs> Is that other whole section there. But yeah, this right here. Now remember the Anuki was teaching us about going on top of poles? Well, we gotta go on top of poles. Now watch this here. I'm, I'm not sure if it's gonna show on the emulator, uh, but let's see if I can get it. Uh, no, it's not. But sometimes in the actual game, there's a graphical glitch that happens over here on this part of the screen that shows some texture from other segments. It's kind of weird, and I don't know why that happens, but it's not doing it on the emulator. So, plus one for the emulator! <laughs> Whoop! Alright. And now... Whoa, 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 careful. Yeah, this is ice, by the way. Watch, 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 watch. Yep, that's ice. <laughs> Anything that's sparkling like that is ice. This sort of stuff... Yeah, that's sort of ice too. It, it's clear. That's another indicator of ice. And ooh, switches. Ooh, hard hat beetles. You gotta hit them from the back, not the front, because they got those things blocking out their headwear. I mean, their headwear blocking out their fronts. And yeah, I'm gonna press these switches randomly and see what happens. I should say, pull these switches randomly. Ah, nothing happened. Well, I can grab this treasure chest at least. It's a big green ruby. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I, I think these things are for, like, I don't know, battling enemies in the future when you hit the switch to flip it around, but it doesn't really affect things that much, so I don't know really why they're here. They just seem to be there for detailing more than anything. <laughs> like, oh, and they also charged you like so, and you gotta get out of their way before they... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's how you defeat them, basically. Because otherwise, if you're just, like, going around them in circles thusly, they'll just keep following you around. You won't be able to hit them. That is the key to your success, is to hit them thusly. Is it, you know, after they charge at you. It's sort of like a mini version of Jolene, actually, come to think of it. <laughs> Jolene is a larger hard hat beetle, I guess. I mean, not uh, stag beetle, excuse me. Hard hat beetle are the um, bouncy ones, yeah. It's one treasure chest. No, I will not, but I do have a plan this time. I'm gonna mark on my map how many treasure chests are left on each floor as I get across to talking to that, just so that I have an idea. Got it? Good. Pull the floor four levers to open the way. First, pull the lever on the far left. Alright, so then we go up here and... Well, that was kind of a bad one, but it's I can tell it's a one. <laughs> so yeah, we gotta figure out the order based on the signages that are around the placages. And hmm, 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 hop! <laughs> Pull the da, 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 draw line due north! Pull the lever in that location lasts, I believe, then that means it's one and then four. The second from the left is number four, if I recall correctly. Then there's one more at the upper left corner. So, whoa, don't you dare roll in a hole! <laughs> Why did I say hard hat beetle when I knew they were stag beetles? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, hard hat beetles, you know they're a completely different enemy. I know they're a completely different enemy, but I said something completely wrong. Oh, you're on a totally different plane there. I can't shoot at you. Hey there. Hi. Hi. <laughs> and now there's the other chest. 
And okay, what's the last one? In the front of the tongue, second. Okay, so tongue it is. Why did I go through? Wait a second, I need to hop. Yeah, through here. <laughs> I'm treating those holes as if they're barriers or something like that. So there's the tongue. That means this is two and this is three. Those are terribly drawn numbers, but that's the order. Always and forever. <laughs> so, one, two, three, three and four. <clears throat> that opens that door. And now we can progress. <laughs> so, 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 so. So, oh, oh. Now, this is a lot trickier on ice. But I might be able to pull this off. Ah! Oh, I, I got you on an easier plane. <laughs> Ha! I'm gonna sneak attack you. Ah! Oh, I hit the wall. <laughs> oh dang it! I can't. I can't get you. Everything's just too tight around here. Yeah. <laughs> that was the toughest stag beetle in the world to defeat. Now, um, uh, now I can hit you guys. Oh, whoa, whoa! What the heck is? Oh. Okay. <laughs> what? Oh. Uh, oh. I, I I can't hit you. I can't hit anything today. <laughs> there, there. <laughs> wow, that was just embarrassing. I want to hit that. That seemed to do nothing. <laughs> I want to hit this. This seemed to do nothing. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I saw it seemed to do nothing a little earlier there, but um, basically, those switches are a part of another order puzzle, and I can't really do that until I get the order. Well, okay, I could do that before I get the order, because I know the order, but I need to get to a certain spot in order to pull it off and whip out the boomerang, and yeah. <laughs> Whee! Switchy switch! Switchy switch! Whoops, why did I do that? I want to get bombs! And throw it over the edge! <laughs> hit the switch! I want to hit the switch! It did nothing. <laughs> so, okay, but really, that opens this here. Which is a prize? It's a wisdom gem! Yeah! But really, that isn't the progress forward. On oh, what I should do here, just so I remember, there are no treasure chests left on this floor. <laughs> uh, oh no, I'm, I'm treating them. Uh, I'm treating the holes as walls again when I can jump them. Okay, so see those right there? Yep, we can now go through them. See, like, what are these for? Are these just to hinder you or something? I don't know. They're just there to be there. <laughs> Alright, so now that I'm over here, stand on the blue tile and follow the numbers below. One, two, three, four! Start from one and go counterclockwise. Boomerang. Boop. Boop. Upper right corner to bottom right. We get a key! Guess how you get that key? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! <laughs> All like a pro! And now we can- oof. I was gonna say, now we can go back without falling off! Well, oh, he fell off. Now we gotta go back around. <laughs> well, I guess I wanted to take a- To show you that around again, you know, just- Just so that, you know, in case- uh, Nah, I can't- I can't fudge my way through this. <laughs> I'm just joking around. Alright, through the door we go, to another floor, and now we're back here, except on the other side. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh no! We need our bombs, we're cornered! Sort of, kinda. Oop. I'm just gonna whip my way, oh, I thought I could've snuck through here. Oh, that's okay. Oop, 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 oop. I thought it was tapping this, mm. eh, eh, eh. <laughs> I need a better camera here. I'm tapping my own eye. God. Yeah. Take that. I don't care about you. I just want to take you on one at a time. Take that. Yeah. And there we go. Yeah, it's. Oof. Why did I do that? That, 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 that removes your stunning effect. <laughs> that was dumb of me. I had you right where I wanted you. And. There we go. I just keep tapping my own icon. I am just sucking in every way imaginable today. And I'm gonna stand right here where the treasure chest is gonna appear. Because it's gonna be fun to watch myself teleport to a different location. <laughs> Woo! 
and this is the dungeon item. Yes, the coveted dungeon item. The grappling hook! Woohoo! Light objects will be pulled towards you. You'll be pulled to heavy objects. So it's sort of like a boomerang, except you're tethered to said thing. And you can only attach things in straight lines. You can also go back and forth, thusly. That is the point of stuff like so. And now... We can go back to other islands to collect their stuff. We can also steal the stag beetles' helmets off <laughs> as an easier way to combat them. And I'm gonna- oh, you zoles! No, no, no! Yeah, okay. <laughs> and whenever you pull their hats, they get a little bit scared and they run away. Because they're like, oh no, I'm not protected anymore, his sword is gonna get me! And we can also pull the tongues! Yes! All the solutions in one item. <laughs> hmm. Okay, now, how do I get across? Well, that's not it. <laughs> it's over there, but I will get that. Yeah! We'll get your hard hat. Well, hard mask off your face before I get to the other side, and I want that kind of. <laughs> yeah! I probably should have swung my sword at that, because if I touch those icicle things, I'll freeze instantly. So that's not a good idea. Um, so now that we're back at the beginning here, we can... <laughs> we can pull these when you're at the right angle. And it opens that up! Woo! Happenies! And now... I guess I'll continue. <laughs> I was looking at that at the time on my camera. Hmm, I see potential. <laughs> I see something bombable and I bomb it. That is how I roll. Ah! <laughs> that is how I roll. And now we can also use the grappling hook for treasure chests. Yeah. Shortcut back. And also, before I move on, is a <laughs> before I move on, there's a bombable wall there. Observe! Yeah! <laughs> and there's also a vulnerable wall here! Observe! Yes! And I'm gonna show you over here. This, of course. It's a big red rupee! And I'm also gonna show you over here, which uh, is not anything that we can actually make progress on. Uh, yeah, I mean, you can you can hit this, but that's not gonna help you whatsoever. But that that's this is sort of like a shortcut for the future, so keep that in mind. Oop. Morning, stand before the great and ominous tightrope challenge. Well, no. You must cross the wobbly tightrope. What, you say? Where is the tightrope? You can make one by connecting a rope between two pegs, can't you? I can! I can! Oh, well, that's another aspect of my uh, grappling hook that I guess I can use. Yes, I now comprehend that life is a tightrope walk. No one knows what will happen in the middle of it. <laughs> so, if we were to do this, we're just gonna fall in the hole. <laughs> But, if we connect two together, and jump up on the post, and then walk across it, look at that! It's like magic. And we can also use this to pull switches. <laughs> it's like magic. And... Now, oh yeah, that's gonna be blocked off. Forgot about that, we gotta do something over here. Ah! I didn't allow myself to stop before I... <laughs> oh, I just pulled out two masks at once! <laughs> Uh, 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 And now, uh, see this? See this tongue? You're gonna want to pull it from as far away as you possibly can. I don't think I could pull it from here. Oh, I can! Yes! Look how far it pulls out! <laughs> and now, that opens that, and it's a time thing. And the further you pull it out, the more time you have. That is why I pulled it out as far as I possibly could. And now, since I have that chest set up ahead of time, woo! Success is mine! Mine, I tell you! And now I don't have to worry about crossing the threshold to get that chest anymore, because I got that right now. <laughs> and opening this will, of course, give us a key! Whee! Oh yeah! That tongue is still beeping. <laughs> See if I can get to the door before it stops. Ah! That's all right. Well, maybe if I would have gotten that chest first and then pushed the block last, that would have been... Eh, whatever. 
So anyway, hitting that, I'm getting that open, will allow us into this treasure chest, which will give us a wisdom gem. And, more importantly, this- Oh no! Oh no! We gotta hit the switch! Can I reach it with this? I think I can reach it with that. Oh, well, maybe. Uh, maybe, maybe. Uh, probably not. I mean, I know the easier way is the boomerang, but I just want to see if this will work. Uh, no, I guess not. <laughs> and then we do the boomerang trail. There we go. <laughs> Alrighty. No, 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 no. Ice, ice is slippery. And now what we're gonna do is do the tight, the tightrope walk challenge. Back the other way. <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 this will allow us to do something else, a little combination of sorts, watch this. You can actually switch items without losing your tightrope, and boomerang, oh wait, wait, that's, that's wrong. <laughs> and boomerang your way around thusly. How do you like those apples? I'm gonna end up hitting that fire key, aren't I? And... I mean fire- not uh, fire, ice keys. Not fire keys, ice keys. Arr, I can't say the names of anything. I can't do anything today. I'm just stinking like I haven't showered in weeks. <laughs> Alright, now I got another sort of challenge here regarding timing, so pull away. I should say regarding a timer, so pull away. Far as you can. And there we go, opens the door way up there. And now go 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 my pointer my pointer I'm gonna kill you to get you out of the way kinda well actually you know what I can do that on my way back if I'd like to because once I get past the door threshold it's just gonna end yeah what happens is once I pass this the time ends I mean the timer ends and yeah we're all good so what do you have to say about this floor Boing! No treasure chest. Oh, I guess maybe I don't have to kill the enemies. I thought there might be an extra prize should I kill off all the critters, but... No, I, I guess not. So I guess I could, in theory, leave... Leave the critters. But... Let's just look around here. Um, we can also do this, by the way. Uh, oh, wait, the, oh, wait, that is the, the pathway we came from before. My bad. <laughs> I am just doing... Terrible commentary, aren't I? And not to mention, just not thinking things through very well. <laughs> ah! <sighs> Maybe what I should do is end it off on that note, because I'm not going to complete this dungeon this part anyway. So I'm going to recoup and end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next parts.